is Mars Bus Land Friends. In this video, I want to explain you a new feature of a Smart Bus Land. In this feature, we have added manual payment. It is related to payment setting. As you know, if you want to set online payment, you have registered on coinpayment.net and have merchant ID. In this feature, you don't have to register on coinpayment.net and instead of that, you only need set your MasterCard or wallet code of your any gateway. Okay, let's go on. One of the places you need to set online payment is on form maker button. Click on bot buttons and click on new create for maker button and if you would like to have this button you have to fill out this form button title and you have to set parent button for example start button and uh, it means that my button is not a subset of another button number of permission allowed I've explained it before, we just set one and the new feature is needed on this section. Okay, we have two options here, free and money. We have to activate money here and type get money, optional or forced. If you set optional, it means that your users can register on your bot without paying you. It's necessary to activate force, not optional. And price, set whatever you need. Authorized number after payment. It determines that how many times your users will use this button after paying you. I just need one time. When I set one, it determines that when a user pay $1,000, for example, he or she can use this button only once. Okay, and the next part, online payment. If I activate it, uh, I have to uh, write my merchant ID or set my merchant ID. And this is my merchant ID, okay? And online payment is just for those who have merchant ID and they have registered on coinpayment.net. But you may have some problems in registering on coinpayment or you would like to set your MasterCard or the wallet code of your any payment gateway. You can activate the manual payment and you can see the default text here. You can change it, write your wallet code here and the text you need. So it's done. Other setting, I've explained it before. And recipients, I would like to emphasize this part. If you would like to activate online payment, it is necessary to activate the operator. and these options. You know, your users have to uh, send a photo of their receipts and the recipient you've set here uh, will receive their receipt. And question title, user response type, set whatever you need. And write your question. And don't forget to click on save. It's okay. Let's see the bot to see all these changes. Write a slash start. And this is the form maker button I've created. Please write your personal ID. If your information is correct, click on yes and you can choose online payment or manual payment. I want to show you manual payment here. This is the text. You can pay the bill via this address. And this section, the important point is that your users 
have to send a photo of their receipt they have to click on get a receipt please send your receipt image it's done are you sure about sending this image yes and you can see this message the image has been successfully received and please wait for admin confirmation and i would like to respond this message as an admin and show you and i go to my admin account and the receipt i've received and i accept it this is the message i've received and you can see the request title request date and more it's done but i wanna show you two important notes one of them is related to currency and i want to show you this is your button registration users if you want to edit it click on this button the currency which it is default is dollar you can change it by going to bot management bots and here click on this yellow button and you can change the currency unit here btc edit and the second point i wanna show you is that bot management then bot setting and button title setting you can change the icons for example i change it it's done if you would like to change the text of online payment button you can change it here click on home bot buttons and edit your form maker button and this is the text i can change it and finally click on edit so my video is done thanks for your support and your interest have a good time